And um, he had quite a hurdle to jump because his challenger was longtime Congressman Pete Stark. But because Eric did have fresh and new ideas and energy and knew what it meant to be in the community that you represent, he did that, he ran, he won, and I am very proud to say that not only has Eric done a fantastic job as Congressman of Union City, but of a, our entire area. When we needed his help in Washington, you see with, be it the um, transportation, railroad issues, or, or anything, Eric's always been there for us. So Eric, I'm sorry I've been so long-winded up here, but at this time I'd like to have you and your two young, wonderful children come on up. Thank you to the band, uh, again, to the Eternity Band. Thank you. First, Happy Thanksgiving. Uh, you know, traditionally uh, in our country, uh, the president will pardon a Thanksgiving turkey. Uh, I don't have any turkey uh, to pardon. I just ask that you pardon my children uh, if they uh, start to act up. So far, this is pretty good uh, by their standards, but I want to introduce to you uh, my son, Nelson, who's two years old. You say hi, Nelson. And our daughter, uh, Cricket, uh, who just turned one. Uh, and uh, so from our family to yours, uh, we want to wish you a happy Thanksgiving and uh, really grateful to Spectrum uh, for the work that they do, uh, not just in Union City, but uh, across uh, the East Bay. Uh, here uh, and uh, appreciate uh, you being so kind to them. And, and behind me, uh, behind these walls, you cannot see, but there's a very hard working uh, staff of uh, volunteers uh, in the kitchen. Uh, they don't just, just do it today, they do it uh, on many, many days. Uh, and uh, so I'm, I'm grateful to uh, the Spectrum staff. I'm grateful to the mayor in Union City and, and Gary Singh and Linda Conless, uh, people uh, who step up and serve the community, uh, helping oftentimes people they'll never meet, but because uh, rooted in them is this uh, idea of service and that we're all here to take care of each other. But I just want to tell you three things I'm grateful for uh, during this uh, week uh, of thanks. Uh, first and foremost, especially in our community, uh, I'm grateful for our diversity. Uh, I don't know if you know this or not, but in our congressional district, 40% of the people who live in our congressional district, from Union City all the way out to Danville, 40% of us were born outside the United States. And we truly are a nation of immigrants, uh, and, and really never more so than right here uh, in Union City. Uh, and we celebrate our diversity all the time, whether it's at St. Anne's Church and the festival uh, they have there, or uh, as we you know, graduate a new class uh, at James Logan High School and look at the diverse faces and uh, know the great things they'll do. Uh, but we celebrate uh, diversity. We also celebrate uh, community. I'm grateful for our community. Just recently we had a town hall uh, at James Logan High School. Uh, it was on this uh, impeachment inquiry that we're undergoing, and I was able to bring John Dean uh, from the Watergate era to Union City uh, and our constituents on both sides, Republicans, Democrats, Independents, showed up, uh, and we had community engagement on a very sensitive topic. Uh, and it was not contentious, people were respectful. I think that says a lot about us uh, here in Union City. Uh, I'm also grateful, third, for uh, our public service. Uh, and uh, particularly here and locally, uh, that means our police and firefighters. Uh, I have two brothers who are police officers in Alameda County. Uh, but I know you, too, are grateful for the first responders, the people who take care of us uh, every day. But also, uh, I have been able to send off uh, two military academies, uh, young men and women from Union City uh, who serve in our armed forces. And let us give thanks to those who are serving abroad right now uh, on our behalf uh, in places very far away from here uh, and not nearly uh, as safe. So for diversity, for community, uh, and for our public servants, uh, we give thanks uh, today, uh, and I, again, I want to give thanks uh, to you uh, for you know, joining and convening here, but also to the, the staff who have worked so hard uh, for us. So, uh, with that, happy Thanksgiving uh, and enjoy uh, the Eternity Band. Thank you. Thank you so much, Congressman, for you taking the time with your two children to be here today. 
I, I grabbed the microphone from him because I was, as I was looking around the room, I did notice one of our senior commissioners, Mila Josue, that's, that's here. So Mila, thank you very much for representing our unions at the senior commission. With that, I'll hand the microphone back to Chris for your further instructions. Thank you, Mayor Carroll. Um, Johnny, do you want to come